Hi, it's Don Sanders, and I'm here today, and we're going to try and do a webinar on using industry web tools to increase order sales. I think the distributors are really weak in some aspects of using uh, technology, and honestly, some are afraid of it, like I am. I'm still afraid of it. I just have to plow through it when I go along. And hopefully we can help you today. Alex Garcia from Distributor Central is going to talk to you about some specifics about web things. And then Lindsay Bonds is from ID Line. Uh, she's going to talk after slide 10 about uh, badge release programs, which I've sold a tremendous amount of name badges. And their badge release programs are really well, are really good. So let's thank all the great suppliers that are on the screen right now. Every one of these suppliers or service providers or people that I've known forever. Promo Social Post does uh, social media for people. Distributors, it's a great thing. And then David Blaze, my friend, has a Smart EQP program and he's got a little downloadable a book that's no charge about how to hire salespeople. So what I'm gonna start off here is I think that we need to employ or create a perfect website. Now a perfect website to me would be one that gets you a lot of business, you know how to use it, it functions properly, and it works for you. And some of the things that you can do with DC, and Alex will talk to you about that in detail, are, is about putting rotating banners on your site, using sticky navigation, product ribbons, how to use category tiles, a logo carousel, how to use a testimonial slider, and as I talked about the social media, how you can use social media or blogs on your distributor central site. It's real important to have an effective site because distributors that don't just honestly just don't sell as much as distributors who do. Now, Alex Garcia has been with Distributor Central forever, and he is gonna to talk to you now for about, oh, three or four minutes and tell you a little bit about what he does. And I, as I say before, majority of distributors have an inadequate web presence so let's let Gal Galax tell us exactly how we can change that are you there Alex I am thanks Don thanks for the introduction uh, let me get this switched over here <clears throat> all right so yeah as Don said my name is Alex Garcia I'm a software support specialist over here at Distributor Central been here for about seven years uh, today just wanted to talk to you guys about uh, DC a little bit if you're new um, if you've been with us for a while, i uh, show you a couple of cool features. Um, so basically the main question we get asked is what is Distributor Central? We get asked that all the time and what sets us apart from our competitors, the other online service providers. So Distributor Central is an online e-commerce platform that basically brings the distributors and suppliers together. Suppliers will upload their products in our database. Distributors can then go in, place orders for those products, build quotes for their customers, presentations, a website like Don said. Um, a lot, and the thing that makes us stick apart from the rest is we offer all our services to distributors at no charge. So people ask, how is that possible? Well, we're sponsored by the top suppliers in the industry, such as ID Line, um, and that way we're able to return offer the uh, services to distributors at no charge. So. Also with that, you get uh, order management tools. So full order management system where you can track orders, uh, you can uh, you know, create proofs and have your customers proof them. Uh, the suppliers can also do that too, uh, to you directly. Uh, we have a built-in light CRM, so you can keep track of correspondence on orders or just on your account in general. And those are just a few things, but I just wanted to show you guys an example of uh, the dashboard. So if, once you log in, you'll have uh, your account number up here and also the name of your company. So your account number is also considered your industry number. So if you're working with the supplier for the first time um, and you need to build that relationship and they ask for your industry number, you can give them your DC number. Um, or if you're registering for a trade show, you can uh, give them your industry number and then that will get you in. Uh, so this is what the dashboard looks like. As you can see, a lot of things on the main page here. But one of the features I wanted to show um, with our special guest today, uh, Lindsay from ID Line, is you can narrow it down to the type of uh, which supplier you want to work with. So for instance, if I come over here to the products tab and I go to product search, 
when it pulls up, it's going to pull up all products from all suppliers. But let's say I only want to look at ID line products. Um, if you look over here on the left hand menu, you'll see that we have uh, filtering here and uh, the names in bold here, the headings. If you go down to supplier and click on view more supplier, and then you can type in the supplier you're looking for. So in this case, we're doing ID line, move them over, hit save. And now I can have the full cat the full category product list of uh, what ID line has. And anytime they update pricing, uh, they update products, it'll automatically update on here. So you'll be able to pull that in. And then another cool feature, uh, this last one I want to talk about is uh, like Don said, when you're building a website and kind of Lindsay will go into, you know, kind of what they specialize in. Uh, you can make, make niche websites for badges for, you know, in, in the example for ID line, um, you can set a preferred supplier, uh, what's called a global filter on your website, where only ID lines products will, or, will uh, show up. And you can create the niche website and pull in, you know, if you want to do a badge website, for instance, you can pull in just their products and none of the other. Because you can see here that I've narrowed it down. It's now down to 1800 with the active filter for the uh, ID line supplier. And if I remove that, then you get all products from all suppliers, um, which is the 355,563. So you can get, you can narrow it down to what you're looking and get very specific on the types of product collections you want. Uh, so I just wanted to show you that real quick. And then as I'm wrapping it up here, um, <clears throat> go to this last slide. So if you guys need to check and see if you have an account or um, you want to sign up for an account, go ahead and scan this QR code in this on the right hand side here. I'll leave it up for a second. And if you have any questions, as always, give us a call 888-516-7401. Our office hours are Monday through Friday at 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Central Standard Time or email us anytime at info at distributorcentral.com. And then Don, I will get that back over to you. That's great. Uh, okay, are you gonna show, get it back to my screen? Yeah, I'm getting it back to you right now. Okay, you should have it. Okay, cool. Well, Alex really is really good at what he does. So when he tells you those things, he's absolutely telling you the truth. Uh, I've used Distributor Central since they started which was like 20 years ago, and they have always treated me correctly. And I think that uh, what Alex says is something that would really be able to, to uh, help you uh, going forward. Now here, I didn't know what to come up with here, so here's what I've come up with. I think that some people have technophobia. We have different phobias about things that we're scared of. Some people are scared of snakes. Some people might be scared of driving in fast cars or whatever it is. And there are others that can, uh, you know, could overcome those th things. And then there are some people that don't. But fear of technology is costing you a huge amount of money and you're paying a really high price for that fear. So if you want to get over that fear, I think that that's necessary if you really want to make some good money selling promotional products especially over the web and i've got some sponsors here of our uh, of our uh presentation promo social post i'm going to talk to you about them uh here's a 50 dollars off an order coupon excuse me for uh <coughs> apogee and david blaze my friend i talk about him at every one of these websites every one of these presentations he has a new hiring guide. Oh, excuse me. <coughs> I'm calling a new hiring guide on how to, how to hire uh, salespeople. And you can take your camera if you've got it out and take a little picture of that go to talk secrets online.com uh, forward slash hire. <coughs> and it'll take you directly to uh, the example of what he's offering. Doesn't cost you anything, but just check it out. It might be helpful for you because we all need to hire salespeople at some point. Now, here are five simple website tips that I think are important. I would add a favicon to your site. I would set up payment processing properly. I uh, would use a top sellers catalog to, uh, to feature different products that you, that you like or you think your customers would like. You need to update your site regularly. Don't keep it static, keep it moving, and you get social. You can also integrate your site with QuickBooks uh, to help you with your order processing and your payment. 
And with Distributor Central, you can do payment processing through PayPal, Stripe, et cetera. And this is really important if you're going to start selling online and getting orders. And we're talking about free samples and scanning things. If you will pick your phone right there and scan that QR code from Edwards right now, it'll take you to a page where you can get a free polo sample from Edwards. That's a great offer. Uh, Edwards is a great supplier. They're really sharp now in the way that you can order your samples by just scanning their QR codes. Now let's talk about favicons. A lot of people don't even know what these things are. I'm not that knowledgeable on it, but I have adapted and gotten over my techno fear and learned what to do with them. And they are icons that you create that go on your website, they go on your emails, they can go on your text. And if somebody gets the F Avicon, they could click on it, it goes directly to your website. I use shoes in my marketing. I wear colorful shoes to shows that I used to speak at or speak at. And there's my Don Sanders marketing card on the left, but the Favicons for my marketing or my distributorship are the two pair of the shoes that you see there on the right, the pair of the, the single blue shoe and the uh, pair of the colorful shoes. Those are favicons. Distributor Central can help you create those or tell you how to do that. These are the neatest thing in the world and you've got to learn about those now. And speaking of cool things, Burla Camp is one of the best suppliers in the industry and you know what, they have plaques. People don't even know that, that Burla Camp has reward or reward and award plaques. They're not that expensive. So if you need plaques, email sales at burlacamp.com and Ken Burla Camp will take care of you in a fine way. And another problem that I think the distributors have is they don't use supplier sites to find out what is acceptable artwork. People do not know the difference between vector art and raster art. I can speak to this directly because I was doing this for 25 years before I knew the difference. I've since learned what the differences are, and vector art is expandable, where raster art is static. If you want the, the, the easiest explanation I can give, and Showdown Displays has a whole uh, instructional part on how to do acceptable artwork files on their website. In fact, they gave me the idea of including it in the webinar because people or distributors need to know about artwork, especially if you're going to get your order flow up and get orders online. And talking about Showdown, they are a great supplier. They have hot market selling items because I just talked about them. I'm gonna mention what they've got. They've got floor displays, complete booths, roll up and tear drop flags, stand up displays. And this quarter, if you buy a table cover, you get a free bag. And I believe they have another offer symbol of this. If you buy other products, you get free carrying cases. And trade shows, networking events, and tailgating are back. These are all great in, in, are great markets to call on for uh, products that Showdown makes. Now, Lindsay's here. I will, she's going to talk to you a minute about badge release programs. And then when she's finished this slide, I'll move to the second slide and then her third slide, but I have sold a lot of name badge programs in my life, and ID Line did all the release programs for me, and they work wonderfully. Are you there, Lindsay? Yes, I'm here. Can you hear me? I can, sure. Perfect, perfect. Well, thank you, John, for having me on this webinar. Again, my name is Lindsay Bonds, and I'm the Senior Business Development Associate at ID Line Halls and Company. And what's great about our company is our online release programs, and we've actually expanded it to more than just badges, but I'll first touch on badges. So many of our options of badges you can put into a release program, and what that means is you're going to order, let's say, 100. Better price break at 100. Uh, release as many as you need right now. So say the company needs 25, they have 25 active employees. You're gonna take shipping on 25 and then 75 will be put into the release program and that will get the charge, but that charge is gonna cover the inventory, shipping and handling. So you'll be invoiced all up front. But what's really nice is every time one's released, you're not gonna get a $5 charge for shipping or another charge. Everything's invoiced up front. And 
it's great we've built out a website that your program will be in there so if you have 10 programs you will see all 10 of your programs and you can click in check how much inventory they have see when the last time your client has purchased or released one but better yet now we have have it where your client can also have a login so they will log in and just see their own program and we can actually put your logo at the top of it so it looks like it's your branded website and what they can do is type in the variable data that they selected so let's say that this piece has first name last name title and a picture so each of those are a line of variable data they would type them in and then the picture they would upload and the badge would come out of our facility in Minnesota 24 to 48 hours later. So it takes a lot off of you of these when they need one badge at a time, they can actually go in and release it. And what we've done from our release program, we've realized that we can put variable data on just about every product that we sell. So why not also offer that as a release program item. So badge event tags, coasters, some sizes of mouse pads, some sizes of counter mats, and all of our leatherette is able to go into that release program. You choose where the variable data will be put on that item. And again, it will come out of our, once you submit the order 24 to 40 hours, eight hours later, it will ship out of our facility in Minnesota. Right, let's go. And if you have any That'd questions, you can go. email. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, well, here, here's we, we thought it would be, yeah. A nicer option so here are some um, coupons that we have going right now for you being a part of Don's webinar some of major product categories that we do have so badges coasters mouse pads buttons will help and challenge coins and leatherette uh, if you look some of them are spec samples and some of them are free setup on an order all you have to do is let your customer service rep know and give them the promo code and they do expire at the end of this year so you have a lot of time to use them and then also if you need any other just random samples or even virtuals, we do random and virtuals for free, you can email those to me and I will get those out to you. All right, I wanted, uh, Lindsay, will you talk to us a minute about the value of customer service? Uh, one thing that really bothers me about some of these huge suppliers is their customer service is all so sure. Yes. So tell Did us- Did you wanna go to the next slide? Yeah, we're, we're there now and why family owned suppliers off, offer superior customer service. Can you see it? Yes, so we are actually now a third generation. Yep, I can see it. We are a third generation family owned business, which is absolutely amazing. Even just the culture here in the office is a family. And these lovely four customer service reps have went with us, each of them a minimum of 20 years. They are so educated on our products and I have learned so much from each of them, but they know the products forward, backwards, upside down. They could tell you just about anything about our products. And again, we're based out of Brooklyn Park, Minnesota, but we're still that family feeling company and they are so educated. They're gonna answer their phones. They're quick with their emails and they back each other up when they're when someone's gone. So you're always gonna get a skilled customer service rep. Well, I think that's really important because the distributors ask me all the time about service they get from the really big mega suppliers. They've done offshore uh, based customer service and the turnover is so high with them. They can't train anybody uh, to do anything because they just don't stay. So, mm -hmm. Uh, if you all have any questions, you can in, email Lindsay about their products. At the end of the webinar, I'll have uh, the email addresses where you can order samples. And do you have any concluding statement, Lindsay, or are you ready to be away from us? Uh, no, I just look forward to hearing from you guys. I've even had people at Expo come up and talk about how they've heard Don talk about us, which is so amazing that there is a community that's all connected and that we can partner together. So thank you. Well, thank you. You did a more than wonderful job. And if anybody has any questions, they can email me or enter, uh, email you at lbonds at idline.com. So let's we'll move along here about uh, promo standards. I bet that a lot of you watching the webinar do not know what promo standards are. Uh, Distributor Central is big into this. And promo standards are something you need to embrace. Uh, basically, the easiest explanation, 
is it is an effort to make to standardize, standardize all industry information passed between suppliers and distributors. That means everything is accurate. A price on one website is the same on another website. That way there is no confusion. One source is the home of promo standards and Tom Mertz with Distributor Central got this going and is a real big advocate of it. So if anybody asks you about promo standards, that's what promo standards are. Just making everything congruent and making it easier for suppliers and distributors to communicate with one another. Now, keeping your site accurate and current is so important because there are a lot of distributors who lie to sell orders. They're lying because they're not keeping their website accurate. They put themselves in a precarious position when they've got suppliers that are that they don't keep uh, suppliers who have not kept their information accurate. Uh, they will look and find a product and come to you and say, well, I need that in eight days. Well, there's no way that you're gonna get that in eight days. It's gonna be a certain time frame. You have the order, then you call the supplier up and you get after them, please, you've gotta do it faster. Well, they've told you up front that that's not the delivery time they can meet. So keep your site accurate to make sure you don't run into problems, which make you have to lie to sell orders. That's just the best way I can put this. And on a positive note, Quickie is one of the greatest suppliers in this industry. They have great key tags, so email info at quickie.com and they'll send you some key, some key tag samples or luggage tag samples. Quickie is just a great supplier. Now, Distributor Central can also help you create company stores. Uh, distributors ask me all the time about the value of stores, how to create them, what to do with them. Well, I would go on Distributor Central and look at their country company store program. They have pop-up stores, niche, niche, shot, niche, niche sites, main sites. Distributor Central can help you set up company stores. I've done a bunch of these things for um, different big customers. And the thing that's great about stores is they keep you connected to your customers. And if you wanted to set up a great company store program, you can do it on custom uniforms with Edwards. My friend Brett Guerin uh, at Edwards, I talk about Edwards in every one of these webinars. He does little 20 minute presentations. He can tell you how to set up stores. He can teach you how to do virtual samples. Edwards has a great site, but what he can help you do is set up custom uniform stores. And that's a great thing to do to keep away your competitors. Now, Here's a big problem with selling online. There are so many dishonest sellers online that you've got to differentiate yourself from them by telling the truth. People will say anything to get orders. So if your customer comes along and says, hey, you know what? I can get this cheaper someplace else, which always used to just bug me to death. I'd say, well, do you want broken mug handles? Uh, do you want to, you know, is that product printed with a toxic ink? Uh, if, they, if they're looking for water and they go, oh, I can get it cheaper than Alexis Springs, I'll say, well, do you want bottled sewer water? They'll say, well, what are you talking about? Well, I'm going to tell you about that in the next slide. But do you want bags with broken handles? These are questions you turn around and ask these people that claim they get stuff cheaper because it might be cheaper, but it is not what they need to buy. So be honest with people. Ask them questions when somebody is always cheaper than you are. Is it the same product? You've got to stay away from competing with this honesty on the web. And there are three very honest suppliers on the on the web on this slide right now: Jimpire, Snugs, and Quickie. I would trust them all with my life. Now here's a hot product I've just come up with. I've got to mention this to you. Take a picture of that, jesse.lovejoy at adcapital.com uh, uh, email address. That pickleball is the biggest thing going, and I mean, you need to be calling on the pickleball market. Distributors ask me, Don, who's, what's a hot market to sell? Well, I'm telling you, pickleball is that Ad Capital has come up with a pickleball sweatband. The difference being, is it has layers that absorb the sweat that take it down into the 
base of the headband and uh, it evaporates. So it keeps the sweat off your head. They also have wristbands. This is a brand new product. This is not even out yet. If you want a sample, there's the email address to get one because I think pickleball is going to be a huge sale in the future. And we're talking about promo social post I mentioned. My friend Greg Blum, Blumstein owns that. He does uh, weekly, uh, he does several uh, times a week newsletters that you can pay him. I think it's $40 a month. It's not much. He'll give you a free month for free to try this. I know him and I recommend what he does because he's a distributor just like me. There is Greg. He started this to help other distributors just like me. Uh, I started my thing to help other distributors. I don't try and steal your accounts. I try and help you sell. Greg can help you with your social media. There's a free month of his service with that ad right there on the screen, or you can email Greg at promosocialpost.com. I know him so well, and he is bright and can help you like no one else. Get your promo social post going. Now, I use healthy habit size. I talk about niche size and distributor central. You can do a hygiene and safety side. Now, let me tell you a different way to put a spin on that. There's my logo or my business card up on the screen to show that the site belongs to me. So I would show on a hygiene and safety side, not only the products, but I would show you why some products are the way they are. So hygiene and safety can be, uh, a bottle of water could be pitched on that side because everyone likes safety. Drinking bottled water that is spring water is safe. Distributors do not know that Aquafina water was sewer water. Pure Life water was sewer water. That is water that's coming from municipal water sources. They are filtered out at processing plants so they won't kill you, but the water does not taste good. So here is a way to explain to your customer how your bottled water from Alexis Springs might be 10 cents a bottle higher, five cents a bottle higher. Well, tell them how bottled water started. There it is, right there on the screen, about bottled water started in 1622. It moved into where they started doing carbonation. PET bottles came, or PET bottles came around. Purified water started. That's the, so the toilet water that has to be processed. People don't know this. So anybody says, oh, Don, I can get that water cheaper. Say, tap and toilet water came from the same source. Don't you deserve better? Well, I didn't come up with that. Brita Filters did it in 2002. Don't let people row you on bottled water orders. Know what you're talking about. That's about explaining the truth. You can use your sites to explain the truth and show just other customer, your customers that you know what you're talking about. Let's look at this box water here. I got that picture off of box water for sale in the Hyatt Hotel in Chicago. Boxed water is not better. It's purified water, it's sewer water, but they're claiming that boxed water is more environmentally friendly, but in actuality, it takes more energy to create a box for water than it does a plastic bottle. And Alexis Springs makes their bottles at their spring in Mount Ida, Arkansas, so there's no shipping on those bottles. They're made there, they're, the bottles are uh, printed, the water is placed in them and they're off to go. So when someone says, oh, I need boxed water, I'd say, why? So suppliers who claim that some products are better than others are just not telling you the truth. This talked a little bit about boxed water and water, but I'm telling you, nothing bothers me more than people that sell against you and don't tell you the truth. Now, how about setting up a wet weather site? It's rained here the last three days. So if I had a wet weather site set up, I could be showing ponchos and I could be selling, showing umbrellas from Southern Plus. On the day it was raining, I would email or text the link to that site to all my customers because it's a wet weather day. What a day to pitch umbrellas and ponchos. Have wet weather sites or have different sites. Have a cold weather site have a hot weather site. I'm trying to teach you to think out of the box by using different sites to sell at certain specific 
times. Here's specific sites for food truck owners. You want to meet decision makers? Go see food trucks. People ask me all the time, Don, how do I get in front of an owner? Well, the owner of a food truck is probably there taking your order. Go call on food trucks, but make a specific site for food truck owners. After you go visit a food truck, get the owner's information, and then email that person your site, which has nothing but food truck owner products on it. That could be color changing cups from Trainer. That could be food packaging from Trainer. It could be napkins from Trainer, or it could be seed paper coffee wraps from Gempire. Gempire has seed products. Harvey at Gempire.com. Harvey's one of the nicest guys nicest people I've ever met in my life. So if you want a cool site, do a food truck owner's site. Just trying to get you to think out of the box a little. Now use MailChimp. If you have low, uh, if you have a thousand email addresses, I think you can use MailChimp for free. You can take MailChimp set up, send out your emails or send out your information to your customers through MailChimp. It's free and it will help you. It's easy to understand. You can use Google Analytics to track campaign results. These are all things that you can learn about through Distributor Central. And right now, Carla Madlock, cmadlock at bensel.com is offering a great light key tag sample. If you want to email her, she'll send, send you one. Bensel's another one of these suppliers with a great website that I would trust with my life. Now here I'm at with David Blaze, my friend, has topsecrets.com forward slash hire. If you will just click on that link at the end of the show, it will take to hit to his promo sales hiring guide. I'm not pushing you on this. It's just that I get asked frequently, Don, what do I do about hiring salespeople? Well, I really don't know what to tell them besides try and do it, or you've got to train them properly. But David's program will teach you how to do this. It's cost you nothing. So all you have to do is log on to topsecrets.com forward slash hire, and you can learn how to do this with no cost associated to you. Now, supplier sites provide better product, product navigation. Distributors love to look through hard catalogs, which I do. But an industry survey that recently came out says that it is three times longer, it takes three times longer to find products on other sources than supplier sites. So instead of thumbing through catalogs or calling customer service and asking about products, go to the websites of these superior suppliers and look at their product options. Two superior suppliers to me would be Bensel. Want that free light? at cmatlock at bensel.com. Or I talked about Burlacamp. They have a great navigable site, sales at burlacamp.com if you want bag tags, or remember, if you want those award plaques. You can watch product videos and create virtual samples of supply of uh, at supplier sites. This gives clients and prospects a reason to contact you. If you want product videos, Edwards has a bunch of them, Snugs has a great selection. And Southern Plus has 87 different product videos that you can send those links to your customers who can watch directly about that product. And if you're looking at doing virtuals, cloth promotions who I've worked with since they started, they have gone from making lens cleaning cloths to all kinds of cool products. They, are, they have a navigable site, which is easy to create virtual samples on. Use these supplier sites for these types of services. It gets you business and it cuts down on your research time. And I've talked about Harvey Mackler, I must. He is so caring and he's done this for so long. He has this little power of promotional products uh, story he's just put out about the guy that was selling hot dogs. I'm not gonna read it to you, but he was using that to, as a way to get a sample of his bookmarks. Harvey is always out looking out for, for distributors. He helped me develop my seed paper business cards, which I've used before. It's a great uh, calling card. If you'd like to have seed paper products, it's harvey at jimpire.com. 
And if you ever have a problem with an order, you can call Harvey directly. There's his direct trial, trial, direct dial phone number. You want your orders delivered on time, know the owner. Harvey will not run from you like these mega suppliers do when you chase down them orders. You'll never be able to call the owner of a mega supplier on the phone, but I'm telling you, you can always call Harvey. You can use FaceTimes with clients to create bonding. If you've got these new iPhones, you can include product images on them when you FaceTime. So if you're gonna FaceTime a customer, what you should do is get some product images in your library. And when you start talking to your customer on the FaceTime, have those product images pop up in front of you and on his on their phone and it's a great way to create bonding and to do a visual product presentation on the fly and a great thing you can talk about with apogee is your swag it war uh, swag it forward program that's where you send uh logos to apogee and they will create an actual product sample for you and then you can send that to your customer, cost you nothing. And then you'll, John will tell you, John uh, Gauchi at, uh, at Abogee will teach you how to follow up on that. This is creative selling here, Swag It Forward program pitched off of a FaceTime account will get you ahead of your customers. And let's talk about entering orders correctly. This is a problem that distributors have. Sometimes we make mistakes on order entry. I've done it myself. I've had shipments go bad just because I put the order in incorrectly. So on Distributor Central, you can enter orders and also the buyer or the supplier can enter ship to, ship to addresses or keep them updated. Distributor Central uses a national database on these uh, address verifications. So like if you enter an order on Distributor Central uh, through Snugs, Snugs has a one day service now on about 300 products. You can get stuff out quickly, enter those orders on Distributor Central and you will make sure that your address is validated. Having an order ship and going to the wrong place is not a happy thing to put up with. Now I order samples from forward thinking suppliers. I mentioned to you about Edwards having QR code supply uh, sample request right there. All you've got to do is take a picture of that QR code, fill out that information, and Edwards will send you a sweater. Here's the polo sample that I talked to you about before. Just scan the code. Here's a free woven shutter, either for when, for ladies or for men. All you have to do is scan these things, takes you to the page, and bingo, they will send you the sample. This is the type of supplier action that you need to use to improve your web-based presence. Now, I've implemented and sustained uh, several marketing programs or prospecting programs. Originally, this was started back a long time ago before we had online capabilities where I would send out cards offering free gifts to different companies. I'd send them to marketing directors of funeral homes, uh, plumbers, lawyers, you name it. They returned the card, I would take them a gift. A pair of scissors, a Schaefer pen, Howard Miller clock. Then I took this online with TradeNet, which is owned by Distributor Central. Uh, or Distributor Central is owned by TradeNet. I did trade back, bounce back cards, they were not bounce back cards, but they were mailers I sent to list. And this specific one was the Grapevine Chamber of Commerce list, had 800 members. I sold this postcard, so I, I mailed this postcard magnet three times to 800 members of the Grapevine Chamber, asking them to visit a specific website and enter orders, which they did. I got eight customers off this program. So if you want to do something really cool, do the same thing offering a Southern Plus uh, piece of drinkware, a chair, a folding chair, a bag. If they go to the website that you from uh, the card that you've mailed, they can fill out the form and then you get that information and you can go deliver their sample to them. This is a lot of talk to, about to, on this program. If you wanna know more specifics about it, just let me know. I'm just trying to give you as much information as I can here as quick as I can. Now, Snugs is always coming out with great products. This is a zip sip. I saw this out at the PPAI Expo. This is a can holder that adjusts to the size of any beverage, from party cups, bottles, 
Pine Slim Cans. This is a brand new product. Samples room at snugzusa.com to find out how to get a sample. This is just a brand new thing, and I like to keep up on these brand new products, just like I was talking to you about the pickleball sweatband. Get out in front with these products, and you'll get there before your competitors. If you want to design custom products, here I'm talking about Edwards again. You can go on their site and design custom products. This is a, a service that they offer, but you can also check out your order status online. A lot of distributors want to email and they want to call when they can go online, get on, this, on the supplier site and check their order status directly. This is much more efficient and you've got a written record of your communication. Be Garen at edwardsgarment.com if you need help checking on order status with Edwards products or if you'd like to learn how to do custom products with Edwards. Now, here's another thing that people do, or distributors do. They call for samples. They email for samples. Don't do that anymore. Go to supplier sites and order samples directly from their sample order functions. The same way you can do with Snugs. You can do this with Innovation Line. I've known Chris Hodge that runs Innovation Line for a long time. They're offering a free uh, pair of socks. In this instance, if you just email C Hodge at Innovation, hyphenline.com, he will send you the socks. But after the webinar, what you would do is go into the Innovation Line uh, website and do a request for samples. But don't be cheap. You've got to have a shipper number. Distributors want these samples shipped out quickly. They don't have a shipper number. The supplier's not done business with them. They're not going to go overboard to help you when they have customers that are already in line who have given them shipper numbers. If you'll enter your shipper number, you get a confirmation. So use supplier sites to enter accurate sample requests and always use a shipper number to make sure you get the sample in a timely manner. Now, Showdown, I've talked to you about previously. You can go on their website and find out all kinds of cool things. I did not know that Showdown had door hanging signs until I started working with them on these webinars. I've sold things for them for 30 years, but I never sold a door sign until I got up on their website. They have a virtual showroom you can visit. It looks just like going to their showroom. They also offer distributor sites just for uh, showdown uh, products. This is a great supplier that you can learn different things from. Now let's talk about creating custom product collections. Many distributors do not know how to do this. What you do to clean it, when you uh, uh, create a collection is you use filters to target specific groups or products that you want to feature. You filter that by keywords, categories, and price points. Let's say we wanted to make an American-made products collection. Now this is a way to think out of the box. We could have an American-made products collection off of Distributor Central, but Merlecamp makes USA-made motorcycle kickstand pads. That's a made, that's an American-made product. Quickie makes a towel hound. That's for uh, for playing golf. That's American-made. Alexis Springs. I've talked to you about water. That certainly is an American-made product. Logo Mass makes mats. American-made product and ID line buttons are made in America. So you can take five suppliers right there to start with an American-made products collection. All the products tie together with one theme. They're American-made. You could also do these on different custom products. Now, I utilize supplier sites to provide accurate shipping. Bottled water is a real problem on this. Alexa Springs ships from seven different locations. So when they give you a freight quote, your freight quote is good. A lot of their competitors will give you freight quotes based on sectional shipping, different parts of the country, and then they give you an upcharge on that. So use supplier sites to get accurate freight quotes. That's for all suppliers who have got a great website. Now you can skip a column uh, with that coupon right there for Alexis Springs, brianalexasprings.com will send you water samples. I pitched water because I hate to see distributors lose bottled water orders because other distributors don't tell you the truth. 
there is Brian's email address again. Now, one thing I talk about are Matt Rental programs. You can get this information off the Logo Matt site. Matt Rentals are a terrible thing for customers or your customers. They pay more, they pay $40 or $50 a month to rent these cheesy mats that are never clean. The rental company doesn't come out and replace them. You could sell a really great mat for $350 from Logo Mats. That mat will last two to three to four years, much cheaper than Matt Rentals. Point this out to your customers because I found this information on the Logo Mat site. There's a 5% off an order coupon from Logo Mats. I recommend them all the time. Now I use supplier chat sites. We're talking again about calling or we're talking about emailing. Now the main thing about doing supplier chat sites is you've got a written record of conversations. Distributors will ask me, Don, you know, so-and-so told me that. I said, well, what did you tell me? Well, the rep told me that on the phone. I said, well, do you have it in writing? No. Well, they don't have a leg to stand on if they don't have written confirmations. Use supplier chat sites. That will help you close orders faster. I think this is our last chance on that polo sample from Edwards, but there are three great coupons from Burla Camp, motorcycle kickstand pans, uh, a stack and custom luggage tags, bag tags. Burla Camp is just a great supplier. Now here's the deal, we're almost finished with the webinar and then Alex is gonna answer some questions for you, so hang on for that. Topsecrets.com forward slash hire. That's the program that David Blaze will send you. The download of that book costs you absolutely nothing so you can see exactly how to hire salespeople. Here's my last pitch on Greg Blumstream. It's Greg at promosocialpost.com. Just email him and say, I want my free month and he will take care of you. And distributors ask me again about these buying programs. They want to know what's the best buying program. Well, there's a bunch of them. The Smarty QP program, David Blaze is involved in this too. There is uh, the URL for smartyqp.com forward slash Don to learn about getting better pricing from a hundred big time suppliers. So people ask me about that. This is the buying program that I would recommend. Now, if you would like to have the replay of the webinar, email me don and sell promo products.com uh here i believe are the accurate email addresses from everyone i've talked about pickleball sweatband is down there at the bottom that's a brand new product you should get out and show that the smarty qp program is shown up there at the top the uh, promo hiring sales guide that's the url for that there's that adjustable drink card holder i'm not going to go through all of these but Alex, do we have any questions? Are you there? Uh, do you have any insight for me? Yeah, I got a couple of questions. Uh, let's take a look here. So we have one that's, uh, what is your self promo program? I think that might be for Lindsay or I don't think that's a DC question. Does that ring a bell, Lindsay? Well, She's Lindsay, I think Lindsay went to a meeting, but I, if somebody is looking for self promo, if they're email me, I, I've got all those for uh, ID line. I will will send those. Plus, I've got some from other suppliers that are okay. uh, really self promo for them. All right, no worries. Um, so we got one that says, "How many different vendors are included on the DC in DC? Currently, we have around 400 suppliers, um, and like I said, with the website, you can fully customize them. So uh, if you have your selected amount of suppliers that you've worked with in the past, you can create your preferred supplier list, add those suppliers, and then continue to add suppliers um, as you go and you build new relationships with them. Uh, if you have a list of suppliers you don't want to work with, you can also exclude certain suppliers from your website and then include all the rest of the ones that we have. Uh, so we pride ourselves on quality versus quantity. So all our suppliers are very credible, very reliable, uh, good suppliers to work with. Um, let, me, let me ask you if uh, quickly, could you tell me what 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 do you think the biggest problem distributors face when they're trying to work with technology? Do you think technophobia is accurate, or do you have a better way? Yeah, to I, I like that? your little uh, word you came up with. Um, 
I think a lot of a lot of uh, distributors um, that come on have been in the industry for a long time, and uh, you know are a little hesitant to learn the new technology. Uh, but it's it's crucial that they do because that's the way we're heading and just in general, um, you know, as a species, our technology is developing in every aspect of life uh, and promotional products is no different. It's going towards that way. And so that's why we provide, you know, as much help as we can. We have help guides, we have help videos, we have shorts, little, you know, two, three minute videos that will walk you through how to do a certain thing like, you know, how do I... How do I find who the supplier is? How do I uh, how do I find the net pricing? Stuff like that. You know, we have all kinds of videos um, at help.distributorcentral.com that you can check out, um, or just contact us on that. But yeah, it's it's kind of like it seems overwhelming, and kind of like you talked about with the company stores, it can be overwhelming because it's something new. But once you learn it, it's a great tool to have, um, especially since you can share it on all platforms. I mean. Your customers can have their own dedicated customer presentation, which could turn into their own website or store. Uh, you can uh, they they can view it on their phone, their tablet, their laptop, and of course desktop. And so it's just you know very uh, very accessible um, on many different platforms. Uh, question: If distributor gets EQP from a supplier, how does that work? <clears throat> so you can still submit your uh, orders through distributor central uh, it won't have the eqp pricing on there it'll unless the supplier list it so whatever the suppliers provided us with the quantities and the pricing is what it's going to display on distributor central on the back end on your dc account and it's also going to display on your website now we do have a feature which i'll talk about here in a second but as far as the eqp goes when you create your order before you submit the order you have the ability to go in and change the pricing. So if you have EQP, you can change it to that pricing. And then when you submit the PO to the supplier, they'll know, and they already have, you already have that relationship with them that you know you get EQP from them um, and they'll process the order. So basically, we'll, Distributor Central will uh, gather everything into a nice PO for them and send it over to them and then they can handle it uh, from there. Uh, I let's see. Does uh, your site replace my ASI site? It's up to you. Um, so all our websites come with a free SSL certificate. Uh, we can host your domain at no charge. Um, like I said, we offer our services to distributors at no charge. So a lot of times, people that already have a Sage or ASI website um, will have us build them a website, or they'll build a website on their own through DC, and then kind of compare and see which one they want to go with. Uh, but you don't have to replace anything. It's up to you, you know, whatever works best for your business. Yeah, the question was for uh, ID line on the self promo thing. We just got to uh, mention in there. If Lindsay's still around. I'll, I'll get a hold of her. She's here, she said. Okay. Okay. Can you hear so, me now? Yeah, 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 they had a question. Okay. What is your self promo program? Yep. So we actually have three different ways for self promo. So one is just um, most products and then it's EQP pricing. And then we have two free versions going on right now. So we would offer a hundred free restickets that you could, it has a calendar on it. We're looking to update that because it's now February. But what you do is have a logo and then your contact information and then we'd ship the hundred free to you. Otherwise, we do have one where it, you get a free badge per salesperson for like the, the distributors, so you can wear it to sales meetings and that kind of stuff. And that you could just email me also at lbonds at idline.com. Okay. Yeah, and if you guys have any questions, uh, feel free to email me directly to agarcia at distributorcentral.com. Um, you don't have to email info at, you can just email me directly. But I think that's going to do it, Don. Okay, well, I want to thank everybody for turning out today. And if you want to email for the replay, uh, it's Don at sellpromoproducts.com. It'll take a while for it to, to download, but I'll have it like this afternoon. But please take advantage of all of our, our, our sample offers. I, I do love that pickleball sweatband, and I do like David Blaze's uh, Top Secrets Hiring Guide. So if uh, I hope everybody has a great day, and we'll have our webinar next month. 
And Lindsay did a great job talking about ID line. And as always, Alex is just excellent. And email him if you have any questions uh, that are over my head, which a lot of them are. And I want to thank everybody. And I hope you just have a great day and sell as many orders as you can.